Hello, YouTube family. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. You are now tuned in with Budget with Shelly. And today we are doing our third paycheck stuffing of July. We'll be stuffing a total of $500 into our sinking funds, our everyday wallet, as well as our challenges. So let's get started. All right, so first things first, hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Shelly, I'm an all cash budgeter. We will be stuffing our sinking funds, our challenges, as well as our everyday wallet. If you are new to my channel, hello, thank you for stopping by. If you are a returning subscriber, hey now, say now, thank you for stopping by once again. All right, so first things first, let's go ahead and count the cash that we will be stuffing today. We will be pulling out our everyday wallet. And in my bank envelope, we'll go ahead and count this cash. So we have 100, 150, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 85, 90, 95, and 500 dollars, okay? So we were able to go to the bank because I do have a $100 bill. Anytime I go to the ATM, my denominations are completely off, but I was able to make it to the bank today. I got up really early. I had a lot of energy and I was able to make moves today. So there we go with the money we'll be stuffing. Let's go ahead and unstuff our everyday wallet. In Shelly, we have a rollover of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven dollars. And we have some change here. That's phenomenal. Gas, of course, is empty. Groceries is empty. Home is also empty. Fun. We have our normal five dollars that we rolled over as well. So we went ahead and emptied that. Let's go ahead and put the money into our challenges. Here is our challenge envelope. Let's start with that one five because I already forgot how many ones I counted. Okay, <laughs> so we have one five. And remember, I do not count this. I'll count this at the end of the challenges. If you were tuned in into my last week video, I completed this $1 savings challenge and I put that money into my emergency fund. So that was good. So I think we had eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ooh. All right, so seven goes in here. This is my third go around with this challenge. So this is phenomenal. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. All right, savings challenges are done. Let's go ahead and put in our coins. All right, so as of today, we have $44.16. We'll be adding, I believe, what is this, about 75 cents here to the to the coin jar. So that should put us at almost $45. All right, we have 44.77. There were two dimes that did not count. This coin machine is not really good at counting the dimes, but we're all done here. Let's go ahead and stuff our everyday wallet. Okay, so for our everyday wallet, we'll start off with my personal envelope. Every week, this gets $25. $25 goes into Shelly. Gas gets its normal $50. And my coworker and I were going to carpool from here on out because we live really close, but she has become pregnant. Yay! <laughs> she's having a little baby <laughs> so because of that and covid and things like that she's very very sensitive so as of right now until you know her pregnancy progresses we will not be carpooling so this 50 dollars will go into my tank and nine times out of ten i will not have rollover like i did last week and the week before okay groceries will go ahead and get forty dollars um, probably next week or the week after, um, I will bump groceries up to probably $50. So that's just an FYI. Groceries are very expensive. So I'm going to bump that up. 
home gets ten dollars this week we are still stocked up with everything that we need so we're good there fun will get its normal five dollars and we're all set for the everyday wallet stuffing let's go ahead and stuff our sinking funds all right we're going into our sinking funds you guys as you know i did hit my 5k goal and my emergency fund we'll go ahead and give ourselves a round of applause once again i'm so excited and happy i will count this every stuffing because i am just so excited that i hit the 5k so we have one two three four five i'll insert the 5k slip here from my bank that has been deposited so we'll be collecting interest on this particular account three to six months we'll go ahead and stuff that with 140 this week so that's 100 and 220s because what i'm doing now is the 100 per week i used to stuff in my emergency fund i will now stuff in my three to six plus the 40 that i was already stuffing there so we're just going to roll everything over so now in three to six months we have 1100 200 300 20 40 60 80 so we have $1,380 into our three to six month. Honey, we'll go ahead and get its normal $50 this week. So honey, we have 200 and we have our last 50. So we have 250 in honey. I think this is the biggest this envelope has gotten. So we're going to cross our fingers that we don't have to pull. <laughs> All right, self-care, we'll go ahead and get $20 this week. So we have 60 in self-care. Dream home, of course, will not get stuffed yet. New car will not get stuffed. Debt will also not get stuffed. In debt, we have $40, okay? And we have not pulled from debt. So... Our high priority sinking funds binder is complete. We'll go ahead and stuff our low priority sinking funds. All right, so low priority sinking funds is a lot thicker than our high priority. <laughs> so vacation, we'll go ahead and stuff with $20. So in vacation, we have a 120, 40, or 120, 30, and 40. So 140 in vacation. Medical will get $10, which needs to be, yeah, probably in the next couple of weeks, I'll go ahead and bump that up. So we have $50 in medical because at the end of the month, this is gonna be unstuffed. So probably next week we'll bump it up. All right, hopefully you can see that. Car maintenance, we'll go ahead and get $20 as well. I do have some tags coming up, so this should be enough to purchase my tags. We have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 in car maintenance. All right, date night, we'll get $20. And we spent it about two weeks ago going to the movies. We had 100 then. Now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. All right, so let's go to a movie again, me and my honey. <laughs> That's phenomenal. Let me go ahead and take a drink really quick. We do have our famous Red Bull in the building. Hmm. Ah, it's nice and cold too. Look at it. Woo! -hoo! all right <laughs> so family we were not stuffing it because um well we didn't stuff it last week because of my emergency fund but we will stuff it this week with five dollars so family now has thirty dollars which is great gifts and birthdays we will go ahead and stuff that with its weekly fifteen dollars so we have a ten and a five so gifts and birthdays, we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, and five dollars in gifts and birthdays. That's great. All right, clothing envelope, which needs to be 
like buffed up a lot because I will be unstuffing it. We have we uh, we have 70 in here and we will be stuffing it with 20. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. <laughs> we have 90 in clothing, which is great. <laughs> And then Black Friday, we will stuff start next month, of course. Our apartment decor, we'll stuff that with 30. So we have 120 and 110. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70. Almost enough for my egg chair. So we're just going to keep continuing to stuff that. And I will get my chair pretty soon. Beauty. We'll go ahead and stuff that with my last 20. As you can see, I got my nails done. Really cute. So this will get unstuffed at the end. I did spend $80 on this set, okay? Including the tip. So hopefully we have 80. But we have 20, 40, 60, 80. Okay, 90. So perfect. So at the end of the month, I have enough to go ahead and pay back my credit card for my, my feel. Well, actually, this is a brand new set. It's really pretty, though. He did great. And then Apple will not get stuffed, but we have 10, 20, 30, 40 in Apple, which is really, really good. All right, perfect. So we're all done with our low priority sinking funds binder. Let's go ahead and close out this video. All right, so thank you guys so very, very much for stopping by on this really quick cash stuffing video. We are making strides in our budget and we are sticking to it, okay? We're making sure that we are hitting those goals as much as possible, okay? I just hit 5K. I mean, I just wanna let you guys know how much freedom that allows me, how much um, of focus that allows me just to maintain my budget okay so believe me you can do it okay just stay positive stay true stay on track and you got it okay i'm your number one supporter so once again thank you guys so very much for stopping by be sure to take care of yourself and each other until next time bye bye Dang.